is up YouTube. Um, good news and bad news. Good news is I'm getting my hair cut. Bad news is I'm uh, three days back into a ketogenic diet, so therefore carb fever um, isn't very pleasant. I'm feeling very lethargic, um, energyless, just like big lack of motivation. I was supposed to be training back today, but I think it's best that I don't, and I just just rest. You know changing your body over from using glycogen as the energy source to then producing ketones in the liver isn't an easy thing to do so I think today I take it easy and then tomorrow morning I'll be in the gym killing the back and biceps uh, train is smart not stupid no longevity is key I don't want to like pass out in the gym and hurt myself but anyway I'm going to get my hair cut in one of the best hairdressers in Luton uh, Blaine's hairdressers. So I'll uh, catch you guys in there. Yo, before I get my haircut, I bumped into one of my buddies. Uh, What's my, going on? <laughs> my buddy Jamie. He's on a Twitch. I'm not too sure what it is, too much, you know, uh, but I know it's to do a gaming. So if you guys are interested, check him out. His name on there is Cheerios on Fire. <laughs> that is Cheerios as in the cereal and on fire. <laughs> Um, I don't encourage you guys to go set fire to Cheerios to see if they are actually flammable. Might I'm sure, yeah, they might taste really good. <laughs> like grilled Cheerios might be nice. But anyway, on Twitch, Cheerios on fire. Check them out and um, see what you guys think. Like and subscribe. Like and always subscribe. <laughs> okay. What's up, guys and girls? We made it to uh, Blaine's hairdressers. My boy Dean is going to be cutting my hair. This is the, uh, the before. And uh, soon we're going to see the after, as long as he doesn't feck it out. out. <laughs> Alright man, he's come to the right spot, we're going to look after him. Fingers crossed. <laughs> <laughs> and now it's the after, That's bringing the after. back that uh, night in style. Yeah man. That's done. Remember guys, get your ass down to Blaine's hairdressers if you're in Luton. Get down there man, get a fresh trim, beer's in the fridge. The beer's are cold waiting for you. <laughs> yeah buddy. Yo. So as I said earlier, back on the ketogenic diet, which is uh, extremely high fat. So I've done a chop and chip video before a while ago, but I'm gonna redo one for just the basic foods you need. Um, obviously green vegetables, so some, uh, some kale, which is uh, important to get in. You can get some broccoli, but be careful because there's quite a lot of carbs in broccoli. Um, and like this diet is almost zero carbs. So no potatoes, all of this stuff here, all potatoes and not on a ketogenic diet. Um, some of you that might suck, but leafy greens like um, spinach, obviously is, uh, eggs, obviously. Um, we can get away with some coleslaw, but also be very, very careful with it. Don't eat too much. Ugh, grab some of that while I'm here. Um, huh, what's next? Macadamia nuts. Getting a good healthy fats on the go. They're down here somewhere. Um, but where? I believe they're over here. So yeah, if you guys are interested in doing this, 75% fat, 20% protein, and hardly any carbs. We say 5% carbs. So um, macadamia nuts are one of the best things you can eat on a um, keto diet. So we get a few packets of them. I mix them with some um, soft cheese, full fat. Um, let me think what is next for today. Nothing else down here. If you want to keep away from everything like this, like anything tinned, keep away from it. Um, even here, like I'm going to buy some unsweetened almond milk, but this isn't actually for me, it's for my partner. Um, yeah, most of this stuff is just, especially if you're a man, don't touch soya. Because it increases your estrogen level and that's not what you want. Um, I'm going to try to be healthy and produce as much natural testosterone as possible. It's another reason why doing this diet is a very good thing to be doing. Um, what's going to be next? So even this oil as well, the sweet oil. These are things you can't even touch, don't even think about it. Only if you're on this diet. Like if you're doing like a you know carb based diet, glycogen based diet, isn't gonna mess you up too much. But when you change from using glycogen to producing ketones in the liver, you cannot get away with eating carbs. Like unless you are like a few weeks into ketosis, 
and even then I'd be very very careful. Her coconut oil is good but I'm gonna order a better one off um, Amazon and um, obviously fatty meats, your bacon, your sausages are all good to eat and um, if I'm gonna get some of these bad boys some pork belly slices make them up, fry them up uh, the rest of the food I'm gonna get from a better butcher than Tesco's because unfortunately Tesco's isn't the best place to buy your meat um, I'd rather go to an actual decent butcher so I'll be doing that a little bit later and most important thing when you're doing a keto is obviously double cream now I drink this I drink this like water the best thing you can have full of your good healthy fats a few tubs of that um, and it's, it's not going to be an in-depth shopping trip just uh, oh yeah avocado as well before I forget avocados are full of all the essential fats you need people just seem to don't kind of understand that if you want to lose fat you have to eat fat because fat doesn't make you fat like sugar makes you fat and unfortunately it's been drilled into us since the 1940s that carb based diets are the way forward and fat diets are the worst thing you can do which is just wrong obviously avocados okay let's see I'll do a better shopping trip later on in the week it's a quick one now okay take it easy what's up guys so now I'm back from shopping and um, I'm gonna do a more in-depth shopping trip maybe next week to explain all the foods you want to buy and that supplement you see behind me is glycofuse this is a supplement you do not want to take if you're doing a ketogenic diet so I won't be taking that um, I have um, a guest in my house today my uh, my girlfriend's sister say hi hey. <laughs> say hi <laughs> A, bit, a little bit shy. Do you want to come say hi? You want to, you want to come here? Okay, she's going to come say hello. Say hello. Hi. This is uh, Patricia. She's very hi. Polish. <laughs> um, yeah, say anything else? No? <laughs> she, she's lost for words. Um, so now I'm cooking up my, uh, my keto meal. Um, I have eggs and spinach. And I have some pork neck. Um, I'm probably going to throw in uh, maybe a few other little bits to add up some more fats inside there. That might be a good idea. Um, you know, fat gains are the most important thing when, when you're trying to obviously eat fat. So guys, if you like this video, please like it, subscribe to it, and leave a nice comment. And leave a horrible comment if you really want. I'll see you guys next time. Peace!